Welcome back to another Technical Tuesday. Today's skill is inside to outside change of edge. Inside to outside change of edge can be seen as part of compound moves used in rumba, quick step, and the tulips from Amsterdam was. In those last three dances, the inside to outside edge makes a beautiful part of a combination of moves, whether that's crossing feet, a change of edge that went before it, but when we're learning a move, we want to make sure we take it in isolation. So let's start with the simplest version we can find. We're going to approach from a forwards run, then rise in the knee and descend as we transfer the weight across to the opposite side. Notice the free leg transitions from tucked behind to finish its journey on its natural side. Now every good cook knows that it's not just the ratio of ingredients used, it's also the timing of when they're added to the dish. So as we're trying to cook up our change of edge, we have to remember that if we want a good weight transfer, we've got to think about the free leg motion, the body weight transfer, the knee action, and the timing of when all of those things are used. So let's grab a wall. We're going to cross the feet and tuck that free leg under, leaning into the wall, rising up on our standing knee, free leg transitions, and descend back in the knee as the free leg stretches out towards the wall. The unison of the free leg and upper body helps to lever ourselves over to the opposite side. For those of you already quite at home with the change of edge, here's a little extra secret skill to really take it to the next level. This extra ingredient can really strengthen the change. So we draw up and gently rotate the standing leg just a few degrees before we descend back into the knee. This little control move is very difficult for a spectator to perceive, but can really add depth to the second circle. So wrapping up our technical Tuesday, just want to give a big shout out and thank you to all our subscribers if you haven't subscribed yet, you know you need to hit that button because we have lots of new content coming out soon. If you'd like to leave us some comments or even requests, do so because this video today was as the result of a request from this YouTuber. You could be next. So why don't you?